Lawson Bates is courting you guys. The 28-year-old reality star confirmed this week that he has a girlfriend who will probably end up being his wife and it's all very good and exciting and unexpected. Unless your name happens to be Jenna Duggar. For years now, the rumor mill has been spinning round and round when it comes to Jenna and Lawson. The two have known each other since they were kids, their families are tied, and let's face it, both are ancient in the eyes of their loved ones when it comes to being single. Heck, most Duggar women are married off by their parents before they are even of legal voting age. But Jenna is 31 years old. She's been linked to Lawson on multiple occasions, most notably last year after they were seen playing board games together and also in early 2019 after Bates appeared to leave a flirty comment on her Instagram page. Back then, Jenna shared her very first Instagram, posting a cute snapshot of her nephews and writing best buddies as a caption to this glimpse of Henry and Spurgeon sitting side by side and looking at a phone. So tech-savvy, Bates wrote with a phone and zany face emojis. See what we mean here. Despite this remark and despite all the speculation you may have read about Dogger and Bates, there's no love connection here. Especially not now. Especially not after Bates went Instagram official with Tiffany S. Benson. Is it the 14586 feed or something else that's taking my breath away, wrote the bringing up Bates star as a caption to the following image. S. Benson is an actress with roles in Spider-Man Homecoming and The Lion Guard, among other projects. We're not sure why she has interested in a traitor to America, but that isn't our focus at the moment. Our focus instead is on Jenna. Is she now doomed to grow old without a man by her side? A few months after she turned 30, Duggar revealed she wanted to find her special someone and longed to be married. She's trying to remain hopeful, but it can be a challenge. One day I think that will come, but I think… I'm just also trying to stay busy with whatever comes along my path, Jenna once said, later adding to People magazine that she's sort of desperate at this point. No, she didn't use this exact word. However, I used to be a little more strict, she said last fall, adding. I felt like I just want to find someone that would either move to Arkansas or is already from here. But I think as time has gone on, I found I do love to travel more than I thought I did. So now it's more like, okay, if I really love the guy, I'll follow him to the ends of the earth. I'll want to go wherever he is. So far, I just haven't found that one. That's it for now. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to stay tuned.